Landmines are treacherous weapons because they last forever. They continue to kill and to maim uh, decades after a conflict is over. They are indiscriminate, they don't make any difference between a soldier and a child. And they are particularly inhuman because they are not actually designed to kill. They are designed to maim badly. My best argument is that today we have 161 countries which have ratified and therefore decided to ban landmines, anti-personal mines. They're banning their production, their transfer, their sales, their use, and uh, these 161 states cover all European states uh, and I would say that countries that are party to NATO or other alliances are also very uh, careful about their national security, they are very protective of their territorial integrity and yet they have come to the conclusion that these are not weapons which have any decisive effect on a conflict or military operation. Well, it's, it's important for those who don't understand that landmines uh, should not exist, that the world is against landmines, that we continue to have victims every year. We have uh, an average of, I would say, 5,000 victims every year of landmines, new old. We have even more victims of explosive remnants of war. When we celebrate the 4th of April or commemorate, we actually talk about the the, 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 those who are exposed to explosive hazards or the unexploded bombs, unexploded shells uh, which, which killed today, which killed um, 18 children in Gaza in the first two months of 2013, which that's unexploded ordinances. The kids that are, and, and the civilians losing their limbs in Mali today, that, that is happening. We need to remember them. We need to remember that we can stop that. We need to also remember that there are deminers who lose their lives, who sacrifice the lives of their families and communities just to make the world safer. My own colleagues who are in 18 countries in the world today who are handling ammunition, weapons, explosives of all sorts, who are trying to see how to protect population from IEDs, uh, the car bombs, the suicide bombers, the, the roadside bombs, we need to remember them and we need to make sure that uh, we put an end to that. Afghanistan can be cleaned if everybody works on it. We have only 570 square kilometers to, to clear in Afghanistan. The end is in sight. We must not forget what is called mine action, what is called uh, landmines, but mine action today um, is really encompassing landmines, cluster munitions, all kinds of explosives. And the UN is committed, and the UN can succeed with the people of this world only if governments are joining and supporting us.